Hi Fire Signs, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, welcome to your weekend tarot reading. We're going to be looking at a love reading here for you to see what's coming up around you and around your romantic connections. So this will be interesting to see um, what could unfold within these next couple of days. Um, if you enjoy this reading, please feel free to like, share and subscribe to the channel to get notifications for readings for your element and your sign, as well as Divine Femme, Divine Masculine readings as well. So having said that, let's jump into the reading and gain some perspective into what's coming up for the fire signs. Okay, straight away, I am drawn to a situation here that has been very, very confusing. Okay, you've got someone trying to sort of manipulate some things in a connection. We've got the devil in the corner, the witches on the broomstick. I feel like it's someone, I mean, we've got children, king of cups. There's love that exists between you and this person, uh, or it's like this person loves you, but they're trying to play you, which is really, really contradicting hypocritical energy. I think there's, there's some things that are coming up here in your love life, and they're going to be quite intense. There's an intensity here. I feel like there's someone around you that's not being completely honest. Now, fire signs, this could be you. I feel like you may be in an energy where you're not living by the standards. It's like a part of you feels like someone doesn't deserve your best side or someone has maybe crossed you, they've done something and maybe this is your way of sort of retaliate, retaliating to that situation. But it's an energy where you feel I don't know, I get, I'm picking up a vibe where some of you sort of just, something has happened recently and it sort of put you off a person or put you off a connection. But like I said, I feel like love does exist here. But there's just, there's just some toxic things that are happening. Okay, there's some, yeah, there's some things that are going on here. Um, the Empress is here, so I'm I'm getting I'm getting some late, major love bombing happening. Someone's being loved bomb, and the other person is just sort of taking it. They're completely mesmerized by the situation. And fire signs, because the Knight of Wands has come up reversed. I feel like this may be you. You may be on the receiving side of someone's little love game plan they've got going on here. It's a very attractive energy though, and it's someone that has made you feel foolish or feel felt manipulated in some way, but they do it so subtly in such a, like, wow, in such a, um, such a, they, they must disguise that manipulation in such a, like, caring way, like, oh, I'm caring, you know, it's that Mother Earth energy, I'm caring and I'm loving and I'm doing this, but really it's part of like this grand plan um to affect you and i think to some extent it's really working fire signs but like you know we get in this energy and we're like blinded by it because it's just so intense and it feels so real i don't think it's completely fake though i wouldn't say that this person but I, I wouldn't say they're completely fake. I feel like there is feelings here. I just feel like their intentions aren't as pure as what you think they would be. Three of ones, chances are they're doing it to other people as well. So some of you, I want to say, like, pull out of that situation immediately if this is happening to you or you have picked up that it will happen to you. You know, it's almost like it's coming as a warning. Um, so sometimes the universe needs to warn us or wants to warn us you know through these channeled messages 
and we have to listen doesn't mean we have to act but we need to listen and take on all those sorts of things we've got the fool but he's reversed um ten of wands is also reversed it's like they make it hard for you to leave them they make it so difficult to make any changes in this connection uh but I feel like there's someone here who's unaffected. So if you're seeing that this person is doing things and they seem so unaffected by it, you know, chances are there's a lot more going on with them than you're actually let, you know, they're actually letting on. Okay. I'm getting a lot of demands being put on you. Okay, a lot of demands and expectations coming through. And it's almost like they're being expected and they're not being communicated. King of Swords reversed is making me feel like someone is just subtly or subliminally. Subliminal? Sub, yeah, on a, on, a, on a subconscious level, they're expecting this from you, but they don't want to tell you what it is. So it's sort of like they're sitting back going, you have to do X, Y, and Z. You have to be X, Y, and Z. You need to act X, Y, and Z. But I'm not going to tell you how to do it. You should know. And, you know, there there's some big shoes to fill here, fire signs. So, again, it could be that that person is doing that to you or you're doing it to them. But it's, yeah, it's a major expectation. And it's just sort of being assumed. So it's like... something about the universe sending you signs but also like assuming things um or when you're in doubt then don't you know there's a lot of cues that you need to pick up pick up on i think i feel here um okay i feel like you need time to think and you need time to process what's going on in a connection six of cups reversed could be an ex coming back in but i don't think you're going to give them the time of day maybe someone from that has done this to you before but i also feel like with the six of cups it's taking the fun out of the connection and you're really starting to notice that and that is creating yeah some some dramas here um in your uh, connection together i feel like you need to assess the situation for what it is it's someone that disguises themselves very well Maybe they have children and they play the perfect partner, the perfect father, the perfect mother, or they're very caring and, you know, but really, I get a sense that it's like a ploy to, to like distract you. A ploy to distract you from what's really going on, what's really happening. So... That's very interesting, very bizarre, but I feel like I want you to keep track of that fire signs. Um, I'll leave it at that. Thank you again for watching. Really does mean a lot. Um, don't forget to drop a like and we'll be in touch soon. Bye for now.